Hey everybody, it's Team Money back again with another update and I'd first like to say Happy New Year to you all. It's 2020 and I'm really hoping that this year will be good for us all. 2019 was a very successful year for me as you could tell with my last update video and I hope it continues on to the next year. Currently, I'm on my second semester of college and it's going well so far. I did very well my first semester and I made Dean's List which I didn't expect. I wanted to create more content after my update video, but I had some technical issues with my PC method, so I needed to figure out a fix for that. I tried to stream Jedi Fallen Order for you all, but it didn't go well. I really loved the game though, especially the ending for all of you who know about it. Also, I would like to mention this semester is going to be pretty packed and challenging, so I am of course going to focus on my schooling and real life before YouTube. I'd like to make more live streams in the future, especially for the new LEGO Star Wars game coming out this year, but I need to figure out a fix before I start live streaming anything. Here's the main reason I'm making this video. I was planning to feature it in my big update video, the last one I uploaded. Now is the time that I should, it should be discussed. Today is January 17th, which many may not know about, but it was the day I got my pet tortoise Spike. He was featured in a lot of my past videos. I had him for many years. I mentioned in my previous video how 2018 was a very difficult year for me. But I did forget to mention something that happened in August. Around that time, my mother and her family went on a so-called vacation to a place that was just an hour south of our home for a week. She ended up doing this at a very inconvenient time for me, so I never really had fun with it. It so happens that this time in 2018, she took my pet tortoise Spike along with us and brought his tank and his other necessities. One night, I, I spent the night at my uncle's house and I, because I didn't get to see him that often, and it, it was a pretty fun night. The next day I come back and my mom was kind of mad at me because I started saying I want to go home and I think this is kind of a waste. And then later that day, apparently, my mom let Spike out for a walk around. She didn't pay attention to him and ended up not able to find where he was. Honestly, I was really pissed off. I spent the entire night looking for him and there was no luck. I had to accept that he was gone. It would have been one thing if I lost him. I had to learn responsibility, but the issue is that I had no involvement. He was let out, he was unsupervised in an area that both he didn't know and we didn't really know. He got lost. It was an awful time and I lost my best friend without any control. I couldn't do anything. It's also pretty hard because when I made Fresh Start a few months prior, I directly mentioned Spike because I had a lot of friends and high school buddies who knew all about Spike because I talk about him all the time in school. It's not going to be the same anymore. It's it's really sad because he could have outlived me. Now I, I just kind of got to accept that he's not around. I want to make this video to explain and leave it in his honor. And I pray and hope that somehow he's still out there and he has his own family and... <laughs> and hanging out with other tortoises or other animals. Yeah, he was he was a real friend. I'm gonna miss you, buddy. Goodbye, Spike. Miss you. We will.